Okay. All right, this is Steve at Downshift Bikes. Today we're gonna to talk about the State All Road Black Label Edition. This is the new bike from State. State came out with the 4130 All Road last year. This is kind of the upgrade to it. Nicer aluminum frame set, a little bit nicer state level componentry, some black label stuff. If you're familiar with their black label lineup, it's a little more high end. It's not as high end as their undefeated line, but it's a more premium build set as compared to their 4130 models. So what makes this bike so cool right out of the box is that it has very, very clean lines. There's not a lot of branding on it. The only thing you really see is the SBC logo here. And there is some black label badges in the frame, but they're very difficult to see with the paint. This is actually a blue sparkle. Um, we'll take it over in the sun here in a minute to show you the sparkles on it. But it is a very dark, very clean looking bike. It is a blue color, like I mentioned, but it does look almost black, especially in low light situations. Josh, if you come forward, we'll talk about some of the components. Everything on this bike is made by the State Bicycle Company. So it's a carbon fiber fork from the State Bicycle Company, alloy wheels from the State Bicycle Company. We've got Vittoria tires. So this is a gravel slash urban slash commuter tire. This is the 700C wheel set. It also can be configured with a 650B uh, wide tire, more off-road capable wheel set. Um, it does have mechanical Tektro brakes. So you'll see that uh, the brake system is a disc brake, 160 millimeter rotors, it is a mechanical uh, pull on there. There's no hydraulics on this bike. You do get a rack mount on this fork, which is cool. It is missing the hole up here for any rack. So any rack that you mount to this bike will have to be sent through the rear of the fork. So that's just something to consider. Um, but it is nice that they give you that little braze on there for that. If we go up a little bit, we can talk about the bars and the shifters. We've got state black label bars, state black label stem, state shifters and levers. And these are very similar to the SRAM double tap setup. So you've got a long press for your, your lower gear and short press for your higher gear. Um, and it's a single lever on the left side for your brake. And then the crank on this thing is a state branded crank. We've got a 40 tooth chain ring. Uh, it is actually really nice quality. It's similar to like what you'd see in a Shimano Holotech crank set with the state little laser etching there. It looks pretty cool. Uh, it's an 11 speed drivetrain. We've got a 40 tooth up front and 11 to 42 in the back. So you got a little better than one to one, which is pretty nice setup for either road riding or gravel riding. State branded clutch derailleur. Um, you've got a little bit of red accents here, which is kind of a neat little flashy thing that's on the bike. We have a sunshine cassette, which we noticed today, which is a little odd, uh, whatever. It's pretty lightweight, it's aluminum, so it's not gonna weigh a ton. Again, state branded rims, state branded hub, a 160 disc rotor in the back. It is through axle front and rear, which is cool. Um, again, the paint is kind of a dark color. Uh, I think we weighed the bike and it weighs in at 22.9 pounds for the 58. So this is the 58 centimeter bike. The sizing is a little wonky on these things. So if you are, um, if you are in the market for this bike, check out your size compared to what they call it. Like this is a very tall 58. Um, they also have like extra small, small, medium, large, um, but I would definitely just pay attention to the sizing on their website before you make any purchases and look at some of the reviews too to make sure that the sizing is going to fit you. Like this bike's way too big for me. Um, but other things to talk about really, you know, this is, this is probably one of State's nicer bikes that they've made lately. Like I like the State Bicycle Company mostly because they produce pretty quality stuff at a pretty competitive price point. So if you're in the market for a bike, you know, I think this retails for 1300 bucks. Um, it's a one by, it can do gravel, it can do road, you can buy two wheel sets for this thing. I mean, it is a fantastic one-up bike for kind of everything you can throw at it. The saddle, on the other hand, <laughs> might need to be uh, replaced with something that's a little more comfortable. This is definitely an urban sort of more retro, you know, fixed gear, single speed style saddle. It's very narrow. Um, if you're gonna do any kind of off-road riding or anything that's a little more endurance focused, you're gonna probably wanna change that saddle out. But overall, great bike for the money, super value, 22 pounds, aluminum, gravel capable, one by 11 speed drivetrain with two axles and a carbon fork for 1300 bucks. Are you kidding me? You really can't do a whole lot better than this that's out there right now, especially in light of the bike shortage and everything that's going on in the industry right now. So don't forget to check this out on our website, downshiftbikes.com. Everything else that we have for sale, new and used, come see us in Roanoke, Virginia. Have a good day.